many Ugandans still do not have access to financial services like savings and credit. Access to financial services for the 18 plus year old population has increased from 57% in 2021 to 72% in 2022, according to Sinovich Uganda Limited, its FinScope 2021 2022 Uganda report. However, a sizable proportion of Ugandans remain financially excluded and underserved, particularly in rural areas. As a result, Eastern community leaders have begun to educate rural people about investing and saving through circles, with almost 1.63 million collected from just Palisa's 528 Baise Igeme subscribers. The saving group hopes to turn a 15% annual profit through value addition. We have to grow everything from our region, process from here, and we finally sell our products when they are ready, sealed. Now that's how you'll get money. That's why Sibusoga Growers was very strong, because we used to do the production from here, especially with different products like cotton processing. I need everyone in this group to start such factories. This will be performed through meetings with a variety of village circles and cooperatives to identify issues and propose solutions. Residents of these villages have so far been able to invest in farming practices due to this mobilization. Local leaders have taken initiatives to ensure project sustainability in the region, including awareness about development trends that they can emulate, particularly in terms of saving and investing. For instance, the Palisa circle groups have been tasked with considering value addition, particularly with sunflower. And these circle groups have come up after saving and they have saved a lot of money and he has promised and is ever ready to support these groups with more money as they continue saving and he has given an appeal to the people of Palisa that we should be able to continue uniting and saving for the development and creating jobs for the people. We should look at products, products like a, for value addition so that we can be able to sell locally and internationally. I appeal the people of Palisa to take this initiative serious. I have donated the three million and I've given one million cash. I want to also contribute and encourage the women of Palisa in the, this group of Baise Igeme. The, the people from Eastern region to grow more sunflowers such that we can make value addition. That's what Honorable Nathan Igeme Naveta wants, such that we can improve our income generating, generating business. For rural communities to have access to financial services, it is essential to support circles and other community-based savings and credit organizations. The execution of pertinent laws and regulations, the presence of powerful apex bodies that encourage the growth of sustainable circles and other factors will help to promote this. Naomi Mtumba, Smart24 TV, Business Today.